Accurate Digital Readout Operating Instructions Bolt Hole Circle. In this video we're going to demonstrate how to set up a bolt hole circle pattern using the Accurate 203 and 300 models. First we're going to demonstrate a full bolt hole circle, then we're going to demonstrate a partial pattern bolt hole circle. Before we get started don't forget to like and subscribe. Okay so in order to set up a bolt hole circle on this DRO First you need to scroll over, hit Features, go over to Circle Pattern over here, and you'll come up with a list. Just choose one. Now for the five hole bolt pattern, you want to choose a full circle, five holes. And then you want to set where your um, center is, whether you want to set it to zero because you've centered your um, table off already or you found your zero in the corner. On this just... particular part, how are you going to set it up? Um, so I've already found the corner of my part uh -huh. and set that up to zero. And I'm using the two inch and the inch and a half reference from that zero so that's, to find that's the right center here. of the part okay. or the bolt hole circle. Okay. You set that up there and you want your start angle to be zero at the 90 degree mark on the bolt hole circle. Okay. And your end angle will automatically be um, figured out from the full whole circle. Then you just go back, hit run, and it will tell you where you need to be using those red dots to get you a visual indicator. If you want to see the layout, just hit view there and it will tell you in blue which hole it's indicating for you to go to at the zero point. And then if you hit next, it'll move on to the next hole, move to zero till this position indicator says zero. Okay, move it, let's see. Okay. And then just go over here. So we're zero zero. So we pretend that we're just going to drill a hole. Yep. Bink bink. We drilled our hole there. So now I want to go to my next position. What do I do? You just hit next again, okay. and it continues. How do I get back to the other screen that you showed with the little red dot on it? Hit the view again. Orbit. Hit view. Red dots aren't there because you need to go to your next hole. And as you get closer to your hole, it zeroes in on the center. Yep. Red dot. It's a little finicky on this machine because it's very sensitive. So this is our third hole position. This is the third hole position. And there you go. And then we're over here. Yep. That's our you third just... hole position. Now we want to go to our first, fourth hole position. Hit next and just repeat. Okay, how do I do this partial one here? You got a partial hole. So we got what? We got uh, four two. holes and they're odd because they're not equally spaced. Okay. Are they equally spaced? They are equally spaced, Okay. but they are not compl a complete circle. Oh, okay. Move over one Okay. to press features, go to circle pattern, and there's choose one of these slots. They could be empty, they could be filled. Choose one. You want to choose segment because it's not a full bolt circle or hole circle. Choose the number of holes. Choose what your center point is, which for this one, it's identical to the previous one. Choose your radius, which in this case is an inch and three quarters. And you want to choose your start angle, which in this case is here. Why is it down there? I honestly don't know. Okay, so it's the bottom one. It's the bottom one. Okay. That's one of where it'll start. Then you choose your start angle, your end angle. So that it tells you how many holes to actually put. Then you go back, hit run, and it's going to point you at your first hole, which if you hit view, show oh, you that there. That looks just like the print. Exactly like the print, and you just, just uh, here. that circle right there. Excellent. 
And if you cycle over, you can just adjust yourself and take it all the way back to zero. Easy visual indicator because it tells so you now exactly. Now I go back to I want to see my print. You do. Boom. Drill your hole wherever it needs nice. to be. Hit next. And it moves on to the next hole. It tells you where to go from there. Next hole. Cool. And just continue on as before. Just hit next every time you've drilled a hole until there. I'm glad to see that you enjoyed the video. If you have any comments or questions, please leave them in the comments section below. A big thank you to Dan, who is my co-creator of this video. As always, don't forget to like and subscribe. It's free and it'll help me out. All you have to do is click on the icon on my face and I'll do the rest. Thank you for watching the video and have a great night.